built the location sensor into Dr. Harding's satellite phone, so we should be getting a reading. I like how they had to throw this in in the first level because we they knew people would be annoyed if, if there weren't any dinosaurs in the first level. Hey, of course the first dinosaurs are conquered. Yeah. You know they broke them out of the first scene. What? Oh, there's more poop. I hope the fat guy can go play in the poop because he sh sucks. <laughs> So true. <laughs> Get over here. Make the screen. Get in here. There you go. Uh, it's we don't need to do that. Dinosaurs, where? His are name you? is Nick Van Owen. Was I? This was Vince Vaughn's first movie, right? I think so. I, I feel like it was. I'm gonna look that up. That can't be right. How do you how do you land your first movie as the sequel to Jurassic Park? Mm -hmm. Go use the bull cutters. What? Hey, hey, hey! Now you're useful. Thank God. No, he just puts it back out. I should love this line. How many Sarahs do you think are on this island? Yeah, it's a great one. Okay, so the first time I'm useful, what am I doing? Also, we're just down here touching ourselves. <laughs> I don't have a projectile. I doubt I can break through this because I'm not a dinosaur. Get your daughter to break in. Oh, here things. we go. <laughs> oh, yeah, no, that wasn't his first movie. Couldn't have been. It was one of the first, though. Yeah. It was his, like, fifth or sixth movie. But I feel like he couldn't have been that popular at the time. No. Like, I, when I think of Vince Vaughn, I don't think, oh yeah, I remember his starring role in The Lost World. Mm hmm We just get the fat guy to sit on there and this thing will stay down. <laughs> as soon as we let go, this should just... Okay, never mind. Alright, game. I was gonna detract the point, but then... Oh, God. Then how do you get down? I just gotta use my my superior martial artist skills. That he I don't think. Did you see what the fat guy was doing? No. He was uh being a little a little fat. No, he was like shaking like Michael J. Fox. <laughs> Shot me. Yeah, he just killed me. <laughs> Fucking prick. Putting prongs. What? What? I don't know. Is this a catapult? No, it's a trebuchet, sort of. Oh my god, these copies are really annoying. I just killed him. Well, that's what he gets. Who can do that? Oh, they won't stop coming. Why did you do that? I hate him. <laughs> Sarah! Sarah Harding! How many Sarahs do you think are on this island? This is awesome. Yeah, that was pretty great. Again, the lines that they choose to include and not include are so bizarre to me. Like, these copies need to stop. Need to stop these. The yard. Wow. I'm done. I'm done. <laughs> I think you need to be up here too. Get the fat guy up here. Hey, I just one of him will do it. Just to put this in perspective, we are currently Jeff Goldblum and Vince Vaughn in a Lego. <laughs> this is what I figured our friendship needed. Yeah. Nice. The fat guy just jumped up here. Wow. It's a giant stegosaur. <laughs> Oh yeah, ooh, ah, that's how it always starts. But then later there's running and then screaming. 
See, like, he's sarcastic in the movie, but he, again, he's the straight man in, in this. Yeah. Which doesn't work for Malcolm. He's much better as the, you know, occasionally witty, you know, chaotician. He doesn't say anything chaotic in the second movie at all. Or does he do anything chaotic? No. The other characters are the ones that are doing the chaotic things with the baby T-Rex and stuff. Also, his uh, his stomp move is a ground pound, like Mario style. Yeah. What? Okay then. Beautiful. Fantastic. Legendary. The world's first selfie. There she is. Hey, Nick! Oh. Ah. Man, I never thought in a million years I'm gonna get you to ah. here. Hey, Addy! Hi, Sarah. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Those animals are just walked by. Did you see them? It's a family group. If I can just get a shot of the nest. I'll be right back. Sarah, no, no! Stay there. Sarah. Sarah. She's much too close. My power is gonna be. Oh, this is a boss battle. All right. Just protecting their baby. Did Goldblum for or just say shoot it? That was, shoot a <laughs> that was his first instinct. I guess so. Oh, all right, that's kind of cool because that's in the movie. What? She hides in a tree stump. I'm gonna beat its face. So, uh. Did that damage it? Yes. Are you fucking kidding me? That's how you. Fascinating. Beat it. What do you mean I can't build that? Isn't she a paleontologist? <clears throat> she. Is she? I think she is. Okay, you know what? It was cute the first time. You try and go in. Or maybe only women can hide in uh, tree stumps. Like Anne Frank. There's no danger here whatsoever. Alright, what's the next? Oh, I see another tree log. Yep. Beautiful. You know, if he has a gun, just use it. He has a tranquilizer that, uh... They can't even feel it before they hit the... What? I don't know, I was trying to remember the line from the movie. Fire! Like, all the other Stegosaurus is just in the background watching. Finish him! Fatality! <laughs> Nick Van Owen wins. <laughs> the greatest Mortal Kombat character. Fire! Fire at base camp! No, water makes smoke billow. You start. Who started a fire? I just wanted to make dinner. Wanted ready when you guys got back. Kelly, Kelly, you have no what idea. Lock her up curiosity? You really came Eddie? on that way? Huh? Really? Oh. I don't get it. It says engine on the on the side of that chopper. 
I don't get that. Why, why would Hammond send two teams? See, I feel like this is, it's, what is this? Is this a race? I hope I win. But, like, it's gonna be weird, because both times you go to Isla Sorna in the movies, it looks completely different. It's true. That's, I think, the thing I don't like about the second and third movies, is that, I don't know, it's just, it's, the location is just way too boring. Eh. Which do you like better? Do you like two or three better? I think three. I do, yeah, I would agree. Two has a lot of great moments, like, I love the scene with the T-Rex in the city. But, um... My only thing is the plot in 3 is kind of phoned in when you think about it. Yeah, there's there's no point. Who are you? What are you doing here? You're dead. You are dead. You're mine now. Expand no expense. How did you jump across the chasm? I didn't. Oh, I don't think I did. I, don't, I, ju I just don't know where I'm going, though. That's the thing. Because the studs aren't here to... Oh, wait. Hold on. There we go. Also, I thought my daughter was Fat Albert there for a second because I saw the red shirt. Hey, hey, hey. I just wanted Diddy to be ready when you came back. Hey, hey, hey. You never keep your word. <laughs> this is the only lines of hers I know from the movie. Mm -hmm. Look at this warp gate. I'm pretty sure that's a race. See, this is, this is what I don't like. I like and I don't like about the new LEGO games being open world. So that sometimes it's just a little weird to figure out where to go. Yeah. Alright, this is probably Gymnast Daughter. Nope. Wait, how did they jump up there? I couldn't do that in a second ago. Who is this for? Maybe you? Or you. No, I didn't want to do that. I feel like the thing we've done the most in this game is like build bridges and stuff to get across like chasms. Remember when I built a bridge between uh, the kids and uh, Dr. Grant in the first game? <laughs> and then now you're going to build a bridge between you and your daughter. Yep. It's going to be great. Okay, so the thing we need to do here is... Um, again, I just want to point out, we are in fact playing as Jeff Goldblum and Vince Vaughn in an open world game about dinosaurs. With Lego people. Nope, not plays Just let that sink in. This looks like a job for... Not you. <laughs> or okay. Vince Vaughn. Alright, I got this. Got him. Got him. <laughs> Got you. Uh, let's see, you try and make it across Vaughn. I just jumped right down. How do you dive? It's just a double jump. Oh, I didn't know you could do that. Sweet. And then we leave them all to die. Uh oh. Seems we're at an impasse. Wait, can someone here dig through poop? Why is it all the women? Just tired of dealing with society shit. Yeah, they get all the crap jobs. Getting some really scenic shots of Vince Vaughn by accident. 